Hello Spelunky fans, welcome back to Spelunky 2. Low percent cosmic attempts. We'll see if we can get all the way back there. So we got to 712 pretty recently. And then uh, had some bad luck. But today's a new day, we'll see how far I can make it. Remember, 799 is possible because if you can beat one cosmic level, you can beat 95. It's just doing the same thing, you just do it, you know, 94 more times, so... Yeah. Alright, this might be Jet here. I don't think there's Ujet here. So if Yang spawns, that means no Ujet's possible. Not the greatest spot for a Skeleboy to show. Um... Not it's super possible, but maybe. Oh no, that uh that key is not remotely achievable. Nope. Not worth the issue. Too many issues past the tissues. So, a uh, new Half Alive track just dropped, a music video anyways. Seems pretty good. How did I miss you? I... Okay. In Spelunky HD, when you fall off a platform, you do it like really, really quickly. But in 2, it's like... Not as quick, apparently. But it's okay, it's dwelling. At least that's don't matter. I just need Ujat to spawn. And then the Ujet will uh, carry me to the drill. And the drill will carry me to Vlad. Oh my gosh, that mole. So moles are like the true final boss of Spelunky. Because they're always funneling around, causing shenanigans. That is a weird key spawn. But I am grateful that I get to play a run. Now I actually want to play a bit safe so I don't get shot by something funny. I have to do more dwelling. I would much rather die in Volcana than have to do more dwelling. <laughs> Even though that's also embarrassing. Look at all those gems though! That level is kind of sick. Okay, I'll see if I can grab some extra gold because I'm a little bit short for Moon Challenge. There is one cricket, and I see two, and I see a chest, we should be fine. Nice try, skeleton. Too bad I'm a gamer. Alright, we're definitely good on money. And we made it to Volcana, so we've got at least that going for us. Oh my gosh, that rock dog sent us extra money just in case we needed it. Oh my gosh, I need a friend like this rock dog, for real. Not that I need money, but just the fact that he was there for me. Thank you, a rock dog. You can pet the dog and just blink too. I wonder if other gimmick accounts look at can you pet the dog and they're just like... Man, our, our gimmick will never... We're never gonna top that one. Hey look, I made a gimmick account where I post that I'm... I say that I'm Elon Musk's foot. This, this is such a wacky idea. Oh my gosh, I did not want that gay man to be flopping all over my face there. That was not, uh, good for my psyche. But I don't know, I feel like gimmick Twitter accounts are kinda over. I'm over them. Oh my gosh, Firebug! Got rid of the enemy for me, thank you. Oh, we got a secret door, and it's not that low either. Nice. Ah, I can't make that jump. <laughs> I 
Goodbye, vampire. Oh my gosh. The back whip is so huge, but sometimes it doesn't hit. Speaking vampire, get away from me. Yucky, yucky. Uh, twilight? More like, get out of my spotlight. Of gaming. I've been watching Dax Flame, and I think he's he might be rubbing up on me. Specifically older Dax Flame. Newer Dax Flame is very different. I took damage for no reason. Which is actually fine for once. Oh god, I got distracted by the lava, and I said I will stand underneath this fire pot. That will surely help my odds of living. But, um, yeah, there goes the lava where it was. <laughs> Sometimes the game surprises me, even after all this time. I mean, there, there just was so much lava right in my face. And I totally forgot there was an imp above me. Because normally I just keep running because there's not lava there, but since there was lava there, I stopped. The lesson is never stop. Much better to run into the lava than to stop because you're scared of the lava. This is the moral of the story. That was a lot of lava there, though. I kind of want to rewind and see, like, could I actually have, have gone through that? Uh, you know what? Yeah, let's watch the Twitch clip back just to see. I don't think it was doable, but maybe if you just ran full force. Here, I'm gonna switch the, there's not lava there. the player. There was lava there, I stopped. The lesson is never stop. Much better. Distracted by the... Actually fine. Alright, so I heard the explosion, like, here. There wasn't really a safe place to stand. I could have fallen down to here. I was a little bit afraid of the secondary imp. But, um, that is oh, looking God. like I, a pretty heavy I flow. Distracted by the lava and I, I could have bombed right here on the middle of that block. And if I did that fast enough, I could have gotten through before the lava overflowed to this tile. That I will stand but that's something that, that would probably end most runs. You could add, like, a air horn effect if I was the editor. What would I do? I do the vine boom effect. I've been watching Lazy Matt, man, and I really like his videos, but I kind of hate how, like, here's a meme that I shoehorned in, and it's not really funny, but I have to put this in because it's a YouTube video. Like, I kind of hate that, like, it's a formality, and Frost Prime also does this, but Frost Prime is a little bit better than how Matman does it. But Matman it does feel like more on topic to what he's saying. But just as a whole, the whole funny sound effect thing. Like I did one funny sound effect in Spelunky Fails, where it was the Mario sound effect when I get hit with the spark ball. But I do think that was funny. But like when you add it in a meme like every two seconds, like Hey, forum, it's me, Ray Williams. <laughs> here's here's a, a vine I found. Anyways, uh, yeah. Weird rant over. Yeah, by the time I got here, there was already lava down. In the, uh, just super pouring. So that must have been... A caveman spawned, pick up the idol, it was connected to a trap. And then there was like TNT down here. Or no, not necessarily TNT. I think there was just... A robot, maybe? Yeah. So the caveman picked up an idol and then there was a robot that exploded, which made the big hole. Because I'm pretty sure with how that's formatted... There wouldn't just be that big, like, 2x2 two two hole. Like, I think that little bit, that 2x2 two two hole, would be gone. Uh, but there should be tiles here, which means they probably exploded. Or maybe there just aren't tiles there and I'm wrong. 
and there was no robot. But if I'm right and it was caveman plus idol plus robot, that is way more unlike <laughs> unlucky for me. <laughs> and yeah, just yeah. The rough thing about holding the bow is that you can't really whip that. And the imp is one tile too high to just jump on. From the falling platform. So that was really just the worst timing. Because you not only have the lava and the imp and this lava man spawning, but that was less of an issue. But anyways, yeah, that's the, the big post-mortem. And then there's that big sad area down here. Oh man, what a run that was. If you enjoyed however short this was, leave a like, comment, subscribe. I will see you in the next one. Peace out.